Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the Pennsylvania toy collector himself. And it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people. And today, we will be reviewing Transformers Creo. Robots in Disguise. Grim Lock. And yeah, he's based on the robots in disguise, Grimlock. In his robot mode. It's not a bad looking robot mode for what it is. It doesn't turn into the uh, T-Rex. But otherwise, it's a good looking robot mode. And he's got this little hammer or mace thing, this little hammer thing, which is kind of pretty cool. But yeah, he does have some articulation due to the extensions they put on these Creo. He's got bend, bendable elbows, which is really nice. So he can bend and get, some, get in some good poses. He can even bend his knees. Ain't that cool? This is the best upgrade to a Creon. If you're not careful, this will come loose. On my copy of this figure, it's very loose, so you've got to be very careful when bending his knee. You can totally bend his knee and be like, me Grimlock gonna smash Decepticons because me Grimlock does what me Grimlock feel like. I'm probably going to display him like this. But now, for comparison, here he is next to Creo Transformers Robots in Disguise Bumblebee. And this is the white armor Bumblebee. He's ready to blast Decepticons and take some names. Let's get those Decepticons, Grimlock. Yeah, I agree on that, Bumblebee. Let's smash them. But now we're going to look at the packaging, since those figures were pretty simple. And these Creo Transformers figures have some nice artwork on the box. Even on the packaging looks really good. And it says, Transformers, more than meets the eye, Creo. 28 pieces. So this is not appropriate for kids under the age of... Of eight or nine. And Grimlock and Hasbro in the Autobot Insignia. That's for you Transformers fans. Now we're going to look at the back of the box. And we get a showcase of all the other figures in this line. I don't have Optimus or uh, Sideswipe or this Bumblebee. But I'm happy with the figures I got. And that's good by my standards. And that's all there is to say for the packaging. And yeah, I've always loved Creo Transformers. They're so adorable and cute. And they're worth adding to your shelf and your collection as little display pieces, man. They're just bundles of adorableness. And they will always have a place in my Transformers collection. Maybe by next year, I'm going to show off my Transformers collection. And then my Star Wars collection. But for now, I did those two collection videos this year. And if you would do me the favor of subscribing to this channel, I would appreciate the support for Eddie Hill's reviews. Because we're always looking for support with subscribers. Also, leave me a nice comment or two if you want to. I would appreciate it. And that's all there is to say for this video. And this is Eddie Hill, the Pennsylvania toy collector. Moving on and rock on and rock out.